Kilometer 0-4-0. Drones are a fast-growing business. Safe and secure integration with civil aviation is needed to achieve the full potential and enjoy the economic advantages of drone technology. Remote identification is a vital component to identify drones around sensitive locations. And it is crucial to find solutions that work for drone pilots, authorities, and manufacturers alike. There are authorities who have the legal powers and a right to know who is flying where and when. That doesn't mean that anyone should be equipped with new hardware, but we believe a system such as Remote ID actually provides the information that's needed for that function. Local Remote ID is a constant signal broadcast from drones to a ground receiver. DJI already includes such solutions in drones available on the market today. This technology is not dependent on any type of internet connectivity, and can be used anywhere in the world to ensure safe identification of drones where needed. The objective of Local Remote ID is to increase drone operator accountability, while at the same time, preserving operational and personal privacy for remote pilots, businesses, and their customers. Aeroscope is an example of what we call Remote ID, and we believe that Remote ID should be the solution for the future. Remote ID is a cheap solution that works here and now and will be available for most drones on the market already. Well, I think Remote ID is one of many different technology solutions that can, that can form an essential part of the overall UTM system in detecting drones. Whether you're a public authority, an airport, a prison or whatever, then we do need a last line of defence in order to counter either malicious drone activity or unintentional flights into non-fly zones. As the market leader, DJI believes that local remote ID is a technology that should be integrated and used to enhance situational awareness. This was successfully shown in the most integrated UTM demonstrator project, Operation Zenith, led by Nats, Manchester Airport, and Altitude Angel. The concept behind Operation Zenith is to imagine what the skies might look like in 10, 15 years' time uh, from a drone perspective. You know, um, in the industry, people are constantly imagining fantastic commercial uses of drones. And the second aspect that was very key to Operation Zenith was to ensure that we can actually put on a very good realistic set of demonstrations, not sequentially, but actually simultaneously. So in, in Operation Zenith you will see cooperative and uncooperative air traffic, you will see ATM integration, UTM cooperation, all coming together on a single common platform at the same time. The drone industry should be in charge of providing the solutions that will allow the drone operations of tomorrow and DJI as the world's leading drone manufacturer has a natural role to play in that.